आई वॉज जस्ट वर्किंग हार्ड डिड नॉट नो दैट आई वॉज क्रिएटिंग हिस्ट्री वेल कितने भी सक्सेसफुल लोगों की बातें और इंटरव्यूज अगर आपने सुने होंगे वो अक्सर यही कहते हैं कि मैं सिर्फ डिटर्मेंट था आई वॉज जस्ट फोकसिंग ऑन माई गोल एंड माई करियर एंड आई डिड नॉट नो कि कब वो चीज़ हिस्ट्री बन गई जिससे आज मैं आपको इंट्रोड्यूस कराने वाली हूँ You are going to remember him for a very long time because he's really, really special, and he's here with us. So let me introduce you to Watts. Hi, Watts. Hello. Very warm welcome. How are you? I'm good. So, uh, what do you feel? Uh, are you excited? Are you happy? Elated? Tell me everything. How do you feel? I'm ecstatic. My preparation for the last two years has really paid off, and it's it's giving me a great feeling. I mean, my parents were relieved, so to speak, because the last two years I've been putting it, giving it my all yeah. for this exam, and the fact that it turned out so well, it's a big relief for me and my family. Absolutely. So, who all are, who all are there in your family? Uh, I heard that you also have a twin brother. Share your experience. What was it like, you know, preparing for NEET with a twin brother who was actually preparing with you as well, right? It was certainly much easier for me. We used to study together and also discuss our doubts. We were in the same class, so that was um, a huge benefit for me. Uh, I could ask him the things that otherwise I would have to go to the teachers for each time, and I think we both benefited from it a lot. Absolutely. So now, um, because of such a wonderful performance, you know, now people are expecting. We need to figure out what what did you know in his preparation. So, any tips, any strategy, advices you want to give to the students who are listening to you right now? Uh I would say need requires a lot of hard work consistency is definitely key and error analysis is the most important like I would uh, after every test I would analyze my errors and uh, try to figure out why I made them and that way I could correct them and not make them in the future Okay so uh you know one thing that you can learn from your mistakes uh, I'm sure you would have your set of mistakes you did something that did not work for you any dark story you would want to share with all of us Uh as such I was able to fix most of my mistakes but uh, certainly sometimes I uh, did approach exams with a lot of anxiety or with a lot of uh, like i would think that i have to score a certain number of marks but it doesn't work that way you can't go into the exam with the mindset that i have to score 720 it uh, otherwise the pressure is too much and it's difficult to even get good marks in that so talking about your family who all are there and how did you decide that you want to go for medicine and not any other field was your parents uh, the reason or you decided on your own tell us my parents certainly motivated me but uh, my elder brother was in the field he's currently in third year mbbs so He motivated me towards it a lot and also I love the subject so it was a pretty clear choice for me. Okay. So usually I ask this question to every student because I want to know uh what's your schedule like? What's your timetable like? Do you prepare like 24 hours in a day? You keep thinking about studying only or you take breaks and if you prefer taking breaks, what do you like to do? Uh so I would study for one and a half hour intervals followed by 15 to 20 sometimes 30 minute breaks depending on how tired I am or how intense the session was. I would generally listen to music or go outside and play a bit in during those 15 to 20 minutes that I had and that would be plenty of refreshment for me. Okay. So um any particular faculty member who helped you in this journey and you know you feel very special and close and connected to that person and any particular moment you remember you know this is one thing that he said to me and I'm going to remember it throughout my life. Uh, actually I feel blessed to have the best uh, faculty members I mean my teachers they were so helpful to me during the entire preparation often they would come to me and ask if I understood the topics other than me having to go to them so they were really helpful in that way and uh, what do you think Akash Baiju's contribution in this entire journey in this entire role uh, how were you introduced to Akash Baiju uh, I gave anthe in 10th grade uh, initially I didn't do it very seriously but then When I took admission for the regular classroom batches then I started preparing seriously with Akash Bhai Jews and the study material the teachers everything was fantastic it was very comprehensive and I think it played a great role in my success What's you know I am not preparing for any competitive exam and still feel so overwhelmed sometimes so aapki strategy kya thi to beat the stress Uh I would meditate every day uh it really helped me calm down and you know sort of get that peace of mind that is required during the exam because often while solving the questions also 
you get stressed out that some of them you're not able to do so you have to bring your mind back to the fact that you know everything and you just have to sort of uh, put it out there okay that's quite interesting so do you advise that you know uh, while preparing for need can we watch television can we watch uh, you know be on social media what did you do i watched a lot of shows uh, especially in 11th i wasn't as serious i'd say i watched a lot of medical shows also i watched the good doctor and other shows also apart from that sitcoms and everything so i i really liked that that was a great past time for me so past times hona zaruri hai it is not mandatory but you know it can help you relax right okay. so um if i have to talk about your you know i was talking to your faculty members and i got to know that there was a phase when you were scoring low to ye difference kaise aapne ekdam se create kiya like i said i wasn't as serious in the initial phases but then i i started doing a bit better and then i got even more motivated to uh, get to my goal earlier i hadn't even thought of you know top 1000 top 100 hours just like if i get a good college i'll be content but later on when i started scoring well i thought that yes i should do this because i have the capability and i just need to put in a bit of hard work for it ओके सो यहाँ पे एक और चीज़ तो मैं आपसे पूछना ही भूल गई आई नीड टू नो कि जब आप यू नो यू थॉट ऑफ बिकमिंग अ डॉक्टर सो व्हाट अबाउट द एक्सपर्टीज हैव यू थॉट कि कौन से फील्ड में आप जाना चाहते हो इन फ्यूचर नॉट येट आई वाज होपिंग आई एड गेट टू नो एन एमबीबीएस आई एड लाइक अ ब्रॉडर व्यू ऑफ हाउ थिंग्स आर बिफोर आई डिसाइड Okay so successful you are and uh, happy we are to have met you so any last uh, minute advice to all those students who are maybe feeling overwhelmed and probably you know pressurized by parents and all these competitive examinations so one tip jo what's dena chahega to everybody i would say try to maintain consistency it definitely gets a bit difficult sometimes but you have to keep the end goal in mind and also have a little bit of faith that it'll all work out in the end that certainly goes a long way okay so it was wonderful talking to you what you were so great and you know i personally love this thing jab aap se inside stories koi share karta hai aur jab aapko wo secret baatein batata hai jahan pe aap bhi figure out kar sakte ho you know you never know ki aapko kab kisi insaan se kya seekhne ko mil jaye to lessons har jagah hai lekin aapko sirf apna horizon ko widen karne ki zarurat hai aur aap agar chahte ho ki aapki life se bhi complications out ho jaye aur solutions inside aaye to uske liye ek platform hai jo aapki life se confusion को गुड बाय कह देगा और वो प्लेटफॉर्म है आकाश बाय जूस तो आज ही विजिट करें आकाश डॉट ए सी डॉट इन